Hi, it's uh, Wendy Bartrell, health tip of the day. And today's tip is women on weights, uh, wendybartrell.com. Uh, the healthy person today is healthy because they honor their body with adequate, adequate rest, nutrition, movement, and recreation. Healthy people typically accept responsibility for themselves because they value their body as a gift of experience through which their soul expresses itself. And that's from Paul Check, the last four doctors you'll ever need. So really health is about that respecting, respecting our bodies. And um, today we're going to talk about women on weights. So why, uh, why do you want to exercise daily? So the average individual adds 10 pounds of fat every decade, loses 5 pounds of muscle every decade, reduces their muscle mass by a third by the age of 60, and strength loss is 12 to 14 percent per decade after the age of 60. And these are all really important because in my uh, view and how I work with my clients, exercise and training and strength training and fitness and nutrition, the whole package is really about having quality of life and being into independent for your whole life. And there are simple tasks. If you can't squat, you can't take care of yourself for your whole life. If you can't raise your, sh your arms above your head, you can't take care of yourself for your whole life. You simply can't get the, uh, um, the plates out of the cupboard, the food out of the cupboard. The, these are all, they sound simple, but they're all really important to consider when you uh, are putting together the reasons why you need to exercise daily. And so the best exercise in the world is the one that you will do regularly. It really needs to be 30 minutes a day minimum, and it should never hurt. Any exercise you do should never hurt, and it, it really should allow you to breathe deeply through your belly. We have come in our society to breathe very shallow, um, we, we don't know how to breathe at all. So learning how to breathe properly and people who breathe optimally rarely or at never get sick and they leave, live longer too. So there are many benefits to, to learning how to breathe and have that be a part of your daily exercise uh, regimen on a daily basis. So how to succeed with exercise. So be specific with your goals. And this is going to keep you on track. And I know a lot of time people get really kind of bored with goals, bored with the why. And, and it really, if you get down to that deep, deep core value as to why you want to exercise, it will keep you on track and give you huge, huge successes. Break it down to daily activities that you know you can win at. So have those daily wins and start today and start winning today because that's going to keep you on track. If you're winning every day at your exercise uh, plan, you're just going to keep going. Track all activities that you do because then you're going to be able to see your daily results. Adjust what's not working for you. So if you're not working or if you're in, you know, causing some kind of pain, then you need to adjust that. Give yourself rewards. As you're reaching your, your goals, give yourself rewards. But they need to be healthy when you're considering your re rewards. And develop a community for your best results. We work better when we work together. Uh, it's a way, you know, to support, to create contests, to have fun. And, you know, that's the last one, enjoy it. It's very important to enjoy. Uh, exercise can be fun. It can be empowering. It, it can allow you to think in different ways. So that's my tip of the day. Women on weights. Thank you. I'm Wendy Bartrell, wendybartrell.com where movement matters, uh, training your inner athlete. Thanks. Have a good day.